Hello guys, today I'm, I'm gonna review a KST servos uh, that I just bought for my project. So, this is the KST X08H version 5, and these are the dimensions, working frequency, and so weight is uh, 8 grams, it's quite light, and yeah operating voltages torque and speed so let's see what's inside you open the box you get a servo and Some of its attachments, and your servo is something like this. It's very beautiful, I must say. I don't know how it will perform, but it's very beautiful and it's efficiently designed. And it has this aluminum frame, it has this coilless motor, I guess. And Let's see the dimensions. It's quite small, I guess. So if I measure like this, it's 28.7 millimeters. And if I measure it like this, it's like 21 mm. And if I made it like this one, it's 13 mm. So, yeah. And one more thing to notice is that these connectors, where you connect the screws, are at the middle. So I was expecting they are. Uh, with some with the level to this uh, particular side but it's not at the level it's in the middle of these uh, two sides so yeah let's see how it performs so, so I have made uh, this simple code with Arduino and um, what the code does is like uh, it uh, rotates the servo from one point to another in one second or in a sine wave fashion so I will be increasing the frequency and the value will be still the same like from 1000 microseconds to 2000 microseconds but the time the value switch will be different as I'll be changing the frequency through the serial port so let's try that one So I have done the connections. Connections are pretty much the same as you would do with any other servo. So the the brown pin, is, brown wire is for the ground. The middle one, the red wire is for the voltage. You can apply it up to eight volts, eight point four volts, and the orange pin is the uh, signal pin. So I have connected it to the Arduino and I uploaded the program. I have the signal pin is going to the pin 8 and then I have connected the 5 volts. So let's pass the frequency of 1 hertz and see how it behaves. Alright, so yeah, 1 hertz. So this is the 1 hertz frequency. Let's move it to 2. Bit faster. Let's do three hertz. Bit more faster. Four hertz. Five hertz. Six hertz. Seven hertz. And like uh, it's too fast, I guess, for this one. 
as we increase the frequency like it's losing its amplitude so back to 2 hertz so again this one back to 7 hertz so yeah it's losing its amplitude back to, uh, to 8 hertz yeah 9 hertz 10 hertz 12 hertz 15 hertz no so yeah back to one hertz this is how it performs so i guess the performance will be a little bit bigger or improved when you connect the higher voltages or maybe this is the power supply from the arduino board which is not very strong and and it should be performing very well so hope this helps in case if you want to buy this one because uh, this will also help you to see what are the dimensions of this, these servos and this is quite lightweight it's, it's super light and very flat you can uh, put it uh, like this on your wing and yeah I mainly bought it because of its dimensions so thanks for watching and cheers